Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If Dying Light the Beast is not launching, keeps crashing or giving you errors on PC, don't worry. In this video, I'll walk you through six proven solutions to fix the problem step by step. Let's get started. Solution 1. Open Steam. Go to your library and find Dying Light the Beast. Right-click it and select Properties. On the left, go to Installed Files. Click Verify Integrity of Game Files. Steam will now scan and repair any missing or corrupted files. Solution 2. In your library, right-click Dying Light the Beast and select Properties. Go to Installed Files, Open Browse Local Files, Open the PHFT folder, Open Work, Open Bin, Open X64, Find Dying Light Game the Beast, .exe, right-click it, and select Properties. Open the Compatibility tab. Check, run this program as an administrator, and disable full screen optimizations. Click Apply, then OK, then relaunch your game. Solution 3. Open the Start menu, and type Device Manager. Open it and expand Display Adapters. Right-click your GPU, and select Update Driver. Choose Search automatically for drivers. Wait for Windows to update your graphics card to the latest version. Solution 4. Open the Start menu and type NVIDIA App. Launch it and go to the Drivers tab. Click Check for updates. If a new driver is available, install it. Solution 5. In Steam, right-click Dying Light the Beast and select Properties. Under the General tab, find Launch Options. Type dash DX11 to run the game using DirectX 11. If that doesn't work, try dash DX12 for DirectX 12. If neither works, leave Launch Options blank. Solution 6. Open the link in this video's description. Scroll down and download both files. V, C, Redist x86 and V, C, Redist x64. Go to your Downloads folder. First run V, C, Redist x64. Click Yes. Accept the terms. Install. Then press Close. Don't restart yet. Now run V, C, Redist x86 and install it the same way. Finally, restart your PC, and that's it. By following these six solutions, you should be able to fix Dying Light the Beast not launching or crashing on your PC. If this video helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment, letting me know which solution worked for you. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.